Hi, if you're watching this video, then this message and guidance is meant for you whenever you find um, this video. Okay, Spirit, what message and guidance do we have today for the person who's currently watching the video? What is it you would want them to know and to be aware of? Right, I've got let go. Let go, and then things will balance out for you. The answer is yes. It's something that you're holding on to. Right, and they're saying here you need to let go basically, let go of everything. You understand? Know Look out for the signs, they're telling you to let go of something. Things are going to balance out. You understand? You're asking your angels for help. Would your angels come in and help you? The answer is yes, they will. But first of all, on your on your um side, what they want you to do, let go of the situation. Don't worry about the outcome and everything. Okay, you want to come out. You need to trust. Some of you lot just don't trust. You don't trust your guys, you don't trust your angels, you don't trust anything. Don't blame you. If you've gone through <coughs> if you've gone through something very difficult and very challenging, sometimes it's very hard to trust. You understand? And you sort of like you want you want confirmation. No doubt that's why you always go to readers, because you want the confirmation that some that everything's gonna be okay. But sometimes, you know what? We have to take a leap of faith. We can ask we can ask many many people for advice and guidance, but sometimes as I often keep telling everybody when they come to see me, sometimes we just have to silence our mind and listen to our own voice, our own instincts. You understand? And silence everyone. Silence me. Silence everybody else who's giving you advice, quick to give you advice and that lot, and go within, and you're probably find that you that you you already know the answers you'd be surprised sometimes when some people come to me and i'm doing reading for them they're talking and i say to them do you know what you've already given me the answer you've so you, you you've already know the answer and you just gave it to me and I'll, I'll, i'm going to tell you what you just said to me you understand but 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 because they were uncertain about their feelings and they and they had listened to so many different people come at it at a different angle and as i tell them Silence, silence all that. Silence me, silence everyone and listen to your voice, listen to your guidance. You understand? And I'll tell you another thing as well, is that I've had people come to me and say, David, oh I had I had a dream and I had this and I had that. You know, they they're getting the answers and then they come to me and ask me, Could you verify it? And I often tell them, Listen, I said, the man upstairs, the big boss upstairs knows knows a lot more than me. And your guides know a lot more than me. I'm being truthfully honest here. And I tell them that, listen to your dreams. Listen to your voice. Listen to your instincts. Anyway, that's me off my soapbox. But let's continue. Okay, Spirit, what else would you like the person who's watching this video to know and be aware of? Right, okay. What else, Spirit, would you like the person who's currently watching this video to know and to be aware of what other messages and guidance do you have for who's ever watching this video or when they find this video <coughs> divine guidance you are asking for divine guidance so remember we said to you let go and the answer is yes and answer your guys they will help you like i told you earlier on they will help you but there's something you need to do you need to start trusting them and step back divine guidance is coming in for you you understand divine timing <laughs> i told you so <laughs> everything happens when it's supposed to happen and not before right and this is where as i said you you have to you really whoever's watching this video you really have to take that leap of faith that that that, that when you jump the universe is going to catch you do you understand all right things will work out it's hard and what did i tell you told you so trust trust in the universe trust that the universe has got your best interests at heart and as i said if you i'm being i'm going to be truthfully honest with you if you want it written on a piece of paper that i hear this is going to happen that's going to happen when this blah 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 and that lot i'm going to be truthfully honest with you. i'm not going to give i can't give that to you and the universe can't give that to you you just have to take that leap of faith you understand all right things but things are going to start emerging for you all right 
things are going to start merging for you. When I'm looking at this as well, I'm feeling as if like some of you are healing for some reason or other. The subs, the stuff that you haven't said, but all is going to start emerging for you. All right, you are growing. You are growing spiritually. So you look again when I'm looking at these cards. I want to tell you, who's ever watching this video, everything that you've gone through, and I told you before. It's all about your spiritual growth. It's all about you growing spiritually. Do you understand what I'm saying? We're not telling you to. We're not telling you to be um, a doormat. Allow people to walk over you because some people tell you that 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 thing about turning the other cheeks, blah blah blah, and all that jazz, right? And like I said, sometimes you know you have to literally tell someone no, and if they slap you or whatever, you know you're gonna have to. Some, well, well, my opinion anyway is that. Someone slaps me. I, I've only got two cheeks. Why should I feel the pain? Let you feel it as well. I belt you back. You understand? But I'm not telling. I'm not. I'm not telling you to do violence. But anyway, all I'm saying is this, right? It's a lesson. In other words, what I'm trying to tell you: yes, you could be very spiritual, but you don't have to be a doormat. Do you understand? All right. But anyway, and if you start trusting in the universe, right? And trusting the guidance, what they're giving to, giving you, you're going to have reasons to celebrate very soon, right? Things are going to work out for you, but it's all a matter for you to start trusting, trusting in the powers to be, right? Serenity, peace of mind. You're going to get some peace of mind. You're going to get harmony, right? And and also as well, tying this into the let go card as well it's like sometimes i feel some people hold on to stuff right and it's like it's causing them a lot of pain and sometimes an anguish sometimes it's best to just let go of the thing let go some people are not even worth arguing with you understand right so let go and let the universe take control of the situation right whatever you're going through let, let it happen forgiveness once again, see what I said to you earlier on about holding on. Too many people are holding on to hurt and anger and stopping their growth. Do you understand? All right? As I told you all the story a long time ago when someone came to me saying, they said something. Oh, I can't remember the story. But anyway, I told her about letting go about something. She said no. And I said, okay, then will you hold on to it and see how far it gets you in life? You understand? And I told her plain and simple, hold on to your pain, hold on to your hurt, hold on to your anger, right? Nobody cares, right? Everybody's got their own problems to deal with. And if you want to hold on to that and, and I not progress in life, that is your choice. That is your choice, right? And I've had people come, come to me crying in my ears. And I told them, don't do that. Don't do that to me. I don't want your negativity and all your bits and pieces and all that lot, I said. You were told and you were warned and you'd made that choice to go to go down that route. Learn from it now. But anyway, that's another story for that. Right? Your support is there. I know I sound tough, I was laughing, but 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 I'm just telling you a lot. I'm just telling you a lot, right? You know, the support is there. We've got free will to choose. Right? Um but the final decision is up to rest. But anyway, your guys, your angels are sending you support. They're sending you healing. But one thing they're saying here, right? In order, in order for things to come through and work for you, you have to let go of some. You have to let go of something. You understand, right? Look at that. Your guardian angels are there for you. They're there. They're there. Um, um. They're there offer you all the support and all the guidance right and they want you to remain positive because like i said to you things are going to work out for you right and i know that when you're going through something it's hard to remain positive but sometimes we just have to we just have to do our best tell them what you want state your intention do you understand at the end of the day as i told you at the very beginning it really is up to you if you want to hold on to the negativity and not learn from it right then um it is up to you if you want to let go of it and grow from it and learn from it and grow from it it is up to you all right anyway that's all i've got for you today and look the final card 
it's up to you to let go at the end of the day basically as i said it is up to you to let go that's all i've got for you today if it resonates with you please click like subscribe follow me on instagram tiktok youtube and facebook you like a personal reading all the information's in the description box you take care now bye bye <music>